Imagine waking up to a reality where this is your world every day. A world where ecosystems are destroyed. A world with a lack of flora and fauna. A world that is closer than we think. We live in it, but we don't observe it thus, taking nature for granted. Isn't it scary if this is our reality one day? So what is so important about our environment, especially our flora and fauna? We live in various countries, but deforestation is a common problem that all of us are facing. With that being said, join us as we explore the importance of life on land and the various efforts one is making to conserve our forests and protect our biodiversity. We interviewed Vijo, the co-founder of Our Land in Thailand. Follow his story as he explains his experiences leaving the automotive industry and setting up a conservation park among the beauty of nature. In this case, I was in the corporate world. I was working with uh, Chevrolet at the time running uh, their digital marketing operations for Thailand and I was uh, very stressed out. I was fairly depressed and very anxious at the amount of pressure that I was on so it was a really stressful job. At that point uh, I had this need to just go closer to nature. I didn't really actively think about it. It was just something I, I kept doing every weekend. I don't think that was actually a choice. People ask me that was so you know how did you make that decision? Actually, I think that nature and uh, the universe actually made the decision for me. And I, I personally believe that the best kind of decisions are the ones that you don't make yourself. Now, let us fly over to Vietnam, where we had the chance to interview Ms. Jung, the president of Song Foundation. Follow her story as she explains to us how the organization was able to step onto the path of sustainable development for her country. We see that the life is in danger. Uh, because people already distract uh, many things from the nature, from the own natural resources, and uh, we have uh, bring ourselves into danger. Uh, the life uh, of people, in, including Vietnam or own Asian uh, country, are affected much. We tend to forget uh, how important that connection to nature is, right? And we also kind of tend to forget that this is actually going to be a huge human rights issue in the future. So firstly, I think that people should be involved in deforestation uh, or the issue of deforestation because this is uh, technically very close to not our hearts, but to our lungs. And, and also another aspect is that we tend to think of it as possibly something that is something that's very far away from us. Right. And I, I think that what you need to realize is that it is not that far away from us. If if people don't uh, don't connect uh, with themselves and with other people and with with the nature in the right way, uh, they cannot protect. Uh, they do not understand about the importance of the nature, and they, they do not uh, protect. The most important project for the um, Green Happiness project is the Forest Symphony. The Forest Symphony, the, actually the concept is that we are organizing people to come to the forest, uh, doing checking, camping, forest bathing, uh, planting trees or doing seed bomb. Then we have one small concert in the, in the forest. That, that is the name why I call Forest Symphony because it is a symphony of compi combining everything, people and the nature, people with each other and you know, they have the, uh, they have the uh, community activity like checking, uh, forest bathing, they also have like concert, uh, combined art and, um, and the nature and local, local artists and international artists. everyone now must take into consideration that what we can do for for ourselves and what we can do for the the whole community um the the kind of uh, social work like us in the past is not very much so uh, is not very much popular uh, they just think that it is that when they have free time they can do that kind of job but but now it become a career 
uh, it be, it become a um a area that people must must take it into a very much consideration and and think about uh, uh, this uh, seriously not just do for free or do like helping or something like that individual actions that we can do uh i'd always say that uh, there there is the very core basics right uh, so the very common things you would hear is that nowadays it's becoming more aware eat less meat it's one of the highest producers of carbon dioxide worldwide uh, and when i mean meat i mean i mean like meat on land and meat in the water too right I, i'm hoping that many of you have seen sea piracy as a clear example of the amount of damage uh, that's causing there so uh, that's i think that that one big step we can take uh, is to move to a lesser meat uh, lesser meat living lifestyle uh besides that uh the things start to get a little bigger using uh using vehicles that uh, were electric right but that becomes really expensive because of the fact that not all of our countries are going to be supporting that kind of system so for me there's one really important thing that i can say that that really matters personally and that is to meditate Medi- the reason why i say meditate is because it is only in the calmness of your mind that you can actually you know you can deal with all the turbulence that's outside of your mind uh so yeah so i'd say that uh, it is definitely an amazing feeling being in nature so as much as you can do spend time in nature as much as you can because it is just such a beautiful and this is scientifically been proven by the way people have been plugged in with electrodes on their head and uh, they walk around in nature and we've, we've proved science has proven that cortisol levels are dropping uh you're less stressed out you're more calm your heartbeat starts to drop uh and uh, your you know your dopamine endorphin oxytocin all the stuff starts to go up all the good stuff goes up so definitely do spend in time time in nature what vijay had said is true if we do not stop in now things are going to deteriorate at a faster rate The young people with the dynamism, with knowledge, with with all the strength, should do that. Should be the one who put into like pioneering to do what, that type of activities. So I I would like to invite and inspire young people to to join with us, to protect the environment, to protect the the people that um um that have uh, like the, the the life is um uh, endangered by the natural disaster, and. Uh, by doing that we can uh, we can help we can support the society to have a better 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 life and in this case this is kind of the same like what can you do for the planet คุณจะทำอะไรเพื่อโลกอะไรที่คุณจะทำเพื่อโลกคุณจะทำอะไรเพื่อโลกคุณจะทำอะไรเพื่อโลกคุณจะทำอะไรเพื่อโลกคุณจะทำอะไรเพื่อโลกคุณจะทำอะไรเพื่อโลกคุณจะทำอะไรเพื่อโลกคุณจะทำอะไรเพื่อโลกคุณจะทำอะไรเพื่อโลกคุณจะทำอะไรเพื่อโลกคุณจะทำอะไรเพื่อโลกคุณจะทำอะไรเพื่อโลกคุณจะทำอะไรเพื่อโลกคุณจะทำอะไรเพื่อโลกคุณจะทำอะไรเพื่อโลกคุณจะทำอะไรเพื่อโลกคุณจะทำอะไรเพื่อโลกคุณจะท